Hello viewers, you are watching Pathology Discussion Forum and today's topic is a very interesting phenomenon observed in histopathology. We call it azoparty effect or azoparty phenomenon. Today we will know what is azoparty effect, how it was discovered and where we usually observe this phenomenon. But before that let me remind you to follow our Facebook page Pathology Discussion Forum after the end of this video to get our upcoming videos instantly. And if you already have followed our page, then thank you for following us. So before wasting your time, let's move on to today's topic. So what is azoparty effect? This is encrustation of basophilic material around the small blood vessels in certain high-grade tumors. Now let me clarify a bit. The phenomenon was initially described by Professor John Z. Azoparty in small cell carcinoma of lung. Small cell carcinoma of lung which was earlier referred to as oat cell carcinoma that is composed of primitive appearing cells. These cells are arranged in sheets, clusters or ribbons and are round to oval and they have hyperchromatic nuclei with scant cytoplasm. Nuclear molding, smudging, atypical mitosis and necrosis are very common. Because of extensive necrosis of these cells, the nuclei disintegrates and subsequently results in release of nucleic acids. These nuclear DNA material gets deposited in the wall of small blood vessels, particularly capillaries and venules. On hematoxylin and eosin stained sections, these are seen as much deep basophilic material less in the blood vessel walls. This is most often seen near the areas of necrosis. Azoparty phenomenon is not specific for small cell carcinoma of lung. It can also be seen in high-grade carcinomas where there is a rapid cell turnover such as meduloblastoma, Merkel cell carcinoma, etc. On hematoxylin eosin stained sections, blood vessels within or close to the tumor and also in the necrotic areas, they exhibit deeply basophilic staining of the vessel wall. Dr. Azopardi correctly identified the basophilic material as DNA in 1959. Before his publication, the material was infrequently described in literature and was presumed to be caused due to calcium deposition. Azopardi examined 100 cases of oat cell carcinoma of lung and identified coarsely granular basophilic material encrusted within vessels in 32 cases. He has noted a strong association of vascular phenomenon with tumor necrosis. Blood vessels in necrotic areas revealed smudged hematoxyphilic material in the vessel wall. The granules in the vessel wall showed negative staining for calcium with von Cossa and alizarin red methods. Azoparty also demonstrated a positive fusion reaction in vascular deposits, suggesting that the basophilic substance was DNA. He subsequently confirmed this by nucleic acid extraction and concluded that the deposition of DNA in the vessel wall is due to results of liberation of nucleic acids in large amounts from the degenerating neoplastic cells. That is how azoparty phenomenon was discovered. So that's it for today. If you like this video and want to watch these types of video in future, then visit and follow our page Pathology Discussion Forum. And if you find this helpful, then don't forget to share this video. Thank you.